In this video, we are going to solve the problem if x to the power of 4 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 4 equals to 322 where x is greater than 1 then find the values of x cube minus 1 divided by x cube x to the power of 5 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 5 and x to the power of 7 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 7. Let's start from part A. Part A is x to the power of 3 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 3. We can find this value by using the identity equation a minus b to the power of 3 is equal to a cube minus b cube minus 3ab multiplied by a minus b where a is equal to x and b is equal to 1 divided by x. Hence, we can write the equation as x minus 1 divided by x to the power of 3 is equal to x cube minus 1 divided by x cube minus 3 multiplied by ab is x multiplied by 1 divided by x multiplied by a minus b which is x minus 1 divided by x. Hence, we have to find the value of x minus 1 divided by x. We can find the value of x minus 1 divided by x by using the given value which is x to the power of 4 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 4 is equal to 322. This is what we are given. We can write x to the power of 4 is x square to the power of 2 plus 1 divided by x square to the power of 2 equals to 322 because 2 multiplied by 2 is equals to 4. Now this is in the form of a square plus b square which is equals to a plus b whole square minus 2ab where a is equals to x square and b is equals to 1 divided by x square. So this gives us a plus b whole square which is x square plus 1 divided by x square to the power of 2 minus 2ab 2 multiplied by a is x square multiplied by b is 1 divided by x square and this is equals to 322. Now x square and 1 divided by x square will cancel out to give x square plus 1 divided by x square to the power of 2 minus 2 equals to 322. Now adding both sides of the equation by 2 gives us here minus 2 and plus 2 will cancel out to give x square plus 1 divided by x square to the power of 2 is equal to 322 plus 2 is 324. Now taking square root of both sides gives us x square plus 1 divided by x square to the power of 2 and square root is 1 by 2 is equal to when we take square root this will become plus or minus plus or minus square root of 324 is 18 plus or minus 18 here 2 and 1 by 2 will cancel out to give x square plus 1 divided by x square is equals to plus or minus 18 in this term both x square and 1 divided by x square are positive. So x square is greater than 0 and 1 divided by x square is greater than 0 because both are square values and squares cannot be negative. Hence x square plus 1 divided by x square this cannot be negative but cannot be less than 0. 
hence we can ignore minus 18 hence the correct value for x square plus 1 divided by x square is equals to 18 now again this is in the form of a square plus b square and the identity equation for a square plus b square is equals to a minus b whole square plus 2ab here a is equals to x and b is equals to 1 divided by x so this gives us a minus b whole square which is x minus 1 divided by x to the power of 2 plus 2 multiplied by age x and b is 1 divided by x is equals to 18 x minus 1 divided by x whole square plus here x and 1 divided by x will cancel out to give 2 plus 2 equals to 18 subtracting both sides of the equation by 2 gives us x minus 1 divided by x to the power of 2 is equals to here plus 2 and minus 2 will cancel out to give 18 minus 2 which is 16 now taking square root to both sides gives us x minus 1 divided by x equals to square root of 16 is plus or minus 4 we are given x is greater than 1 since x is greater than 1 1 divided by x 1 divided by x will be less than 1 we have x minus 1 divided by x equals to plus or minus 4 since this value is greater than 1 and this value is less than 1 the subtraction of x and 1 by x cannot be negative because we are subtracting a greater value from a smaller value hence x minus 1 divided by x is always greater than 0 hence x minus 1 divided by x is equals to 4 now we will find the value of x cube minus 1 divided by x cube using the formula so this gives us x minus 1 divided by x is equals to 4 hence 4 to the power of 3 is equals to x cube minus here x and 1 divided by x will cancel out to give 3 multiplied by 1 multiplied by x minus 1 divided by x is equals to 4 minus 1 divided by x cube this gives us 4 to the power of 3 is 64 equals to x to the power of 3 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 3 minus 3 multiplied by 4 is 12 now adding both sides of the equation by 12 gives us that plus 12 and minus 12 will cancel out to give x to the power of 3 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 3 is equals to 64 and 12 is 76 so this is our answer for part a now we have to find x to the power of 5 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 5 we can find this value by multiplying x cube minus 1 divided by x cube and x square plus 1 divided by x square so this gives us first we will multiply x cube by x square x cube multiplied by x square then plus x cube multiplied by 1 divided by x square now we will multiply minus 1 divided by x cube with x square and 10 with 1 divided by x square so this gives us minus 1 divided by x cube multiplied by x square minus 
1 divided by x cube multiplied by 1 divided by x square. So this is equals to x to the power of 3 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 3 multiplied by x square plus 1 divided by x square. So this gives us x to the power of 3 multiplied by x to the power of 2 is x to the power of 3 plus 2 is 5 plus your x to the power of 3 will cancel out with x square to give x. So x to the power of 5 plus x minus here x square will cancel out with x cube to give x in the denominator. So x minus 1 divided by x minus 1 divided by x to the power of 3 and x squared in the denominator will give x to the power of 3 plus 2 which is 5 is equals to x to the power of 3 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 3 multiplied by x square plus 1 divided by x square. So this gives us x to the power of 5. Here we have minus 1 divided by x to the power of 5 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 5 plus this value we have find before is 4 equals to this value is we have found 76. 76 multiplied by x square plus 1 divided by x square that we have found is 18 x square plus 1 divided by x square is 18 so 76 multiplied by 18 so this gives us x to the power of 5 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 5 plus 4 equals to 76 multiplied by 18 is 1368 subtracting both sides by 4 gives us x to the power of 5 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 5 is equals to 1368 minus 4 is 1364 so this is our answer. Now let's move to part C which is x to the power of 7 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 7. Since we need x to the power of 7 we have to multiply x to the power of 4 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 4 by x to the power of 3 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 3. So this gives us x to the power of 4 multiplied by x to the power of 3 minus x to the power of 4 multiplied by 1 divided by x to the power of 3 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 4 multiplied by x to the power of 3 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 4 multiplied by 1 divided by x to the power of 3. So this gives us x to the power of 4 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 4 multiplied by x to the power of 3 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 3 equals to x to the power of 4 and 3 is x to the power of 7 minus x to the power of 4 divided by x to the power of 3 is x plus x to the power of 3 divided by x to the power of 4 is 1 divided by x minus 1 divided by x to the power of 4 and x to the power of 3 is 1 divided by x to the power of 7. We are given x to the power of 4 plus 1 divided by x to the power of 3 is 322 multiplied by x to the power of 3 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 3 is 76. This is equals to x to the power of 7 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 7 
taking minus 1 common here gives us minus of x minus 1 divided by x. 322 multiplied by 76 is 244 72 equals to x to the power of 7 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 7 minus x minus 1 divided by x is 4. Adding 4 to both sides gives x to the power of 7 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 7 equals to 2472 plus 4 which is equals to 24476. Hence the answer for part C is x to the power of 7 minus 1 divided by x to the power of 7 is equals to 24476.